this band underneath. I always like to treble our uh, horses with clay nets. Um, they're grazers and they're used to having um, plenty of forage. So um, they'll travel with the hay net and then we'll take the hay net away when we get there so that um, they won't have hay in their mouths when we tack up. Normally for international shows, the tack and equipment and everything goes in trunks in the back of the lorry. Um, but for a day show, with a couple of horses. Um, the tack will be in the side of the lorry for easy access so that we can get them tacked up quickly when we get to the show and the riders can get on. So we're setting off now, everything's loaded, double checked everything, so we'll see you at the show later. So we've arrived here at Hunter's Equestrian. We got here about an hour to an hour and a half before the test. Um, give the horses a chance to rest up and then uh, need to get tacked up and get them ready so I'll probably warm him up for about 45 minutes. So that's my job to make sure I've got everything here um, so we can get him ready. So we can have boots on to warm up because they're easy to get off. Um, make sure he's got the right number on. Make sure Carl's got the right boots and jacket and hat to wear. Um, so there's a lot to think about. Now we've got the jockey on and they're in the warm up. So my job is just to tidy up the lorry, make sure everything's ready for when they come back. Um, and then I'll go down to the arena with a bag with spares in and um, sugars, cloth, sweat scraper, sponge, all the sort of essentials. Um, if it's really hot, then I'll take a, a bucket of water as well in case they need washing down. Um, if they have a little break, uh, while they're training and they're really hot then I might wash them down, sweat scrape them and towel them off and dry them off. Um, and I um, need to be on hand for anything that the rider might need. Um, and then about 10 minutes before the test I'll take off the boots um, and give them a last wipe down before they go into the arena. So um, that's sort of my job um, at a day show. I was really happy with Ekitov there, how he um, went today. That's only his second Grand Prix, and um, I think for him to come out there at his age, he's 10, so that's very young. Uh, good year to start, but he's, he's quite young. Um, it's just so fun to ride. He's my pet. I've had him since he was two years old, uh, and that makes it extra special because I've known him all the way through. We've had ups and downs. It took three of us to get him in the arena at the National Championships two years ago. That was just to do an advanced medium. That's all he's done in his life. Um, some advanced medium and a few young horse classes. So, very inexperienced. And I mean, he can, you know, you can feel there that he can really do this Grand Prix. So I'm looking forward to the next few years with him and um, seeing how it improves as he gets stronger. But delighted with the performance of what a day in March. We have to ride out here in the sunshine. So yeah, it was a wonderful day. now and um, I hope you enjoyed the little background um, shots into how we do things um, and uh, hopefully see you again soon.